Hello friends, this is Jackie from Keep It Simple Stickers and welcome to another weekly plan with me. This week we're going to be filming for the week of Monday, May 4th through Sunday, May 10th, I think, yep, which is Mother's Day. And of course, I'm going to be using the beloved Tons of Love kit. I've just pulled a few pieces here and there to show you. Um, in, uh, well, you'll see, you'll see. Um, let me go through what I have pulled. So I have pulled items from the Vibrant Matte listings as well as from the Foiled listings. And I believe I pulled two diff the two different foil colors. So if you elect to purchase this kit as a foiled kit, you will choose between silver or purple. So I've pulled one of each of those two foils to show you. And then I pulled two sheets of the um, Vibrant Matte as well, just my regular mat. So I pulled the glitter headers in vibrant mat, and then the um, silver full boxes there with the hearts. And then I pulled the purple um, foiled mix boxes page. And then I pulled the vibrant mat um, bottom washi sheet. So I'm going to really quickly see if I have checklists available. Um, if not, we're going to have to do a little bit of finagling, but I'll be right back. All right, friends, I'm back. I do not have any checklists, believe it or not, in either the Vibrant mat or my Premium mat. So I I'll see what I have with my stash. I could do check flags, or I might just leave that line blank and add it in at the end after this video is done. We'll see. We'll see if time allows me to do that. Um, but if not, just know I will put a to-do list sometime, sometime within the kit. All right, so let's get on with what we have. All of these sheets are a la carte is kind of what I wanted to let you know. They're all a la carte, so you can pick and choose if you want to mix and match your foil, your paper types. You can do whatever, you know, suits you best. So let's get going don't have a ton of time. Story of my life. Um, Joe just left with the kids on a walk. It's super nice outside. So I wanted to try and get this filmed. And then you guys, girls, mans, sirs, I have a bunch of new foil bunch. Okay. I have three new foils, <laughs> but to me, that's a lot. Um, at one time that I just got in and I am like, itching 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 to test it out to do some some test prints and foiling i'm just really excited to to get that to see what those look like see what the new foils look like i got a like pink holographic i got a rainbow and then i got like a silver sparkly star one which i think I might do with the 4th of July kit. Right now it's silver, but I might change it to silver sequins. Oh, I know, I'm just, I'm super, super excited to do all the foil stuff. So I'm hoping to get that done and I'm, I will allow Kate to help me with those tests because she loves, she love, 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 loves doing stuff like that. She loves foil. Um, I think I've mentioned that before. Okay, so I have these from With Love from KT, and I'm thinking that I'm going to use some of these gray toned ones down here. I think a lot of them could certainly work for my purposes, and I have enough. I have seven. So let's just go ahead and pull this sheet out. I don't know if With Love from KT is still open. I got these years ago, you guys, like when I first opened my shop. So I, I honestly, I, I do not know if she is open or not, but definitely check it out if you are interested, um, if you're interested in something like this. And I know a lot of other shops also offer things of that nature. All right, so I'm going to pull as well from Melissa, one of my meals um, boxes. I just passed them right here. Let's see if I have a color that could work. The blue is already jumping out at me. I'm thinking the lighter blue though. I'm looking at this glitter and I definitely think that that would be the best fit. And because I have all of my full boxes, I'm gonna go back over here. I don't need to use this within 
my Monday like I did last week, which I feel like that spread turned out pretty nicely. I do like how it, I do like how it turned out. Um, my handwriting is kind of a mess. It's all over the place with that planner spread, but I feel like overall it looked, it looked nice. All right, so after that, I'm going to do my trackers, and I do have three trackers to choose from. I do want to pick the purple. It's one of my favorite colors in this kit. I think I'm going to do both purples. I don't know what I'm tracking. Last week, I was going to go back and start tracking my moods within my Bujo. I haven't tracked one day, friends. I know, it's like, Jackie, that is what a tracker is for, honey. You need, you need to actually track things because... What's the point of having it if you're not going to track it? I'm hearing what you're saying, people. I just am not the best with the follow through. With the follow through. All right, so let's go ahead and use a three lip up here for work. Just plunk that right there. And I do have an Etsy header from Chasing Chels, but I don't know if I want to use that or continue with the glitter headers. I really do like the glitter headers. I feel like it looks nice. Yeah, let's let's keep that going and let's see which one do I need to use next. Well, I don't need to use they're in any sort of order, but we'll do that and then we'll finish off with a full box and we'll have our sidebar situation done. I'm loving how my sidebar looks every week. Just the uniformity is really pleasing to me. And we'll use this beautiful vibrant matte. Actually, no, this isn't vibrant matte. I'm sorry, this is the unicorn because it's foiled, y'all. Yes, looks so nice. Love that, love that. All right, so I need to see what I want my, how I want my full boxes to look. I think I wanna put them all along the top. Yes, I think that I'm going to do that. And, hmm, I have one, two, three elephants. Cause I kinda wanna separate the elephants, you know what I mean? And let's go ahead and let's start with this white one. So how's everybody doing today, friends? I hope you are doing well. We are doing really great. Um, Joe worked in the yard for a long time today, honey. A long, long time today. Um, he had to get some items from Lowe's to... Um, like our with our weed whacker um, he needed a new string and new oil and he had to go to the gas station like it was a whole it was a whole thing today friends so he got that all situated and um, was working on the yard and it looks really nice he he actually ran out of string believe it or not um, in the middle of his in the middle of his work but um the stuff that he did get done looks really nice he fertilized yeah he did all the things today and now the kids and him are out for a walk it's a really nice day it's about 75 degrees out today and um like we had to put sunscreen on the kids <laughs> my daughter wanted to go through the sprinkler so we have two dogs and unfortunately they are both diggers and one of them is worse than the other. His name is Harris. And he will dig holes and they'll like, you know, eat dirt, you know, the whole dogs, the whole thing. And it's, I would love to tell you that I know why they do it. And quite honestly, I don't know why they do it because they were home, obviously, right now. They get, they get a walk every day from my husband. It's, it's just, it's very strange. But my husband, uh, earlier this week, he filled all of the holes from Harris and Rosie. Rosie's our other dog. He filled all the holes and he put grass seed down and he was watering the grass today before, was it before lunchtime? No, it was before Jason's nap. So right after lunch, but before Jason's nap. And Kate saw it and wanted to go into the sprinkler. She wanted to get her bathing suit on. She wanted to do the whole thing, honey. So I was like, okay, go get your swimsuit on. And it, at that point, it really wasn't that warm. But both Joe and I were like, okay, go ahead and get it in. So I helped her get it on. And Jason was in his swing. We got him a little bucket swing for Easter. And he's just kind of watching the whole thing. And then we're like, Jay, do you want to go in the water with Sissy? 
and he did you guys he was a little shivery baby because he was just in his diaper y'all we went outside before um before kate wanted to um go through the sprinkler we were just outside playing and jason like toddles out in his diaper and i'm like jay you gotta get at that point it was one of those like all right let's just let's just roll with it i'm gonna use the lavender too as well friends um we're like let's just roll with it and so we did you guys and he went out in his diaper and then he was just having a ball in the water it was the sweetest little thing he is so sweet just love him to bits so kids had a really good time we were joe and i were just laughing and it was it was really nice so um do we like sure so they were outside in the water and you know swinging both my kids love to swing and it's funny i was telling caitlin from cllk09 we all know caitlin we all love caitlin um i was telling her that my kids we had a baby swing you know i got i had put one of those on my registry because everybody swore up and down that you need to have a swing your baby will sleep in it yada 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 so of course we got went on our registry we got it from i think people i used to work with you know whatever neither one of my kids liked the swing at all i want to say we use that swing probably five times maybe even less to like put the kids to sleep i think kate maybe fell asleep i remember distinctly one time one time she slept in there i think jason one time as well so I was convinced, like, my kids just don't like, they just don't like the swing. Like, they're not going to like regular swings. And I loved swinging as a kid. Like, I remember doing that all the time as a kid at, during recess and whatnot. That was, like, my go-to would be going on the swings. And so I was like, oh, well, that's sad. They're not going to want to, you know, they're not going to want to go on regular swings. But they love regular swings, Kate loves when i give her underdogs do we all remember underdogs from the, the schoolyard where you like run underneath someone's legs and you pray you pray that you don't get smacked in the head or in the face she loves those when i give her those and jason love he just loves swinging he'll like lean his little head back it's the cutest cutest thing he's so funny um so i'm thankful i'm glad i'm glad that they like to swing now um jason especially he'll do it all the time he'll do it all the time he will just not stop he would stay there the whole day if we let him so it's very very funny so i imagine after they get back from their walk i will see them swinging outside with with daddy so that's what they are up to so we've been working in the yard this week we put some mulch down yesterday we just you know we're doing what we can um a few of the stores in michigan um, our governor has lifted a few restrictions so you can go and buy plants and nurseries are open and whatnot. So a little bit, a little bit has opened up here and there. Um, so Joe just went to Lowe's. He wasn't going all over creation yesterday because, um, Lowe's is, is relatively close to us. So I think that I'm going to do these two. I'm going to layer these two. I'm going to put this purple one right here along the dots. And then I will just layer that bottom one, butt it up right close, and that will be nice. That will be nice. I love this bottom washi. I think it's so precious. It's so precious, y'all. I love it. I love it. So cute. Um, I love this kit. This this kit, it's so interesting. This kit and my Moose on the Loose kit, they're probably my top two best sellers. And it's like moose on the loose during the winter time, tons of love during the spring and early summer. Like you definitely like, I got my animal people and I love it because you all know I love animals too. So it's just so precious. I think I've reformatted this kit three times now with the foil would be the third time. So it's fun. It's fun to like see the progression of kits that I've had in my repertoire for so long, it's really fun. All right, so let's go ahead and let's do some day by day. Um, a, a, a few things this week, which is nice. Um, 
Monday is my Facebook giveaway. So I'm going to use an appointment label and then I am going to use my transparent stickers from Jen over at Craft Penguin Planner, my fellow co-admin and sweet dear friend Jen. Um, these ones I have used a few times now. I'm getting some traction, Jen! Yes, honey. I'm also going to use my Instagram ones from Jen, which I believe are also either in this album or in my functional album. Let's go ahead and use, while I'm looking at this, this work script from my shop, I'll put that within my um, sidebar sitchy sitch. Just looking to see what I have, friends. Cheerful Plan Girl, she's in the sale with me. Sticker Patch, Melissa is in the sale with me. Tilly B Plans, she's in the sale with me, friends. We just, we got all the heavy hitters in this month's sale, honey. We love all of our friends. So, I'm going to go ahead and lay this down from Jen. So my Facebook giveaway will be on Monday the 4th. And then Wednesday is my Instagram takeover. So for consistency, I'm also going to use an appointment label from the full boxes page. So we'll put that there. And then Jen, I got to find, I got to find my Instagram icons, girl. I need to find them. And if not, I will use something else from, yep, right here. My craft thing, my planner, transparent. Oh, Jen, how long do these take to cut? An age? An age and a half. Do tell the friends, Jen, how long does it cut to cut those little teeny tiny circles? Woo! All right. Uh, let's see. So Monday is my Facebook giveaway. It is a $15 shop credit as well as a full sheet of custom little bits. So definitely make sure you head over to the Planners Collaborative Facebook group to check that out. Um, my... Takeover on the Real TPC IG is Wednesday. Also, the Live with Caitlin is on Wednesday. So let's use one of these foils. I'm going to use the lavender. And I'm going to put that down here. And this is the big old Live with Caitlin. And let's see. I'm going to pull some icons. I think I'm going to pull some foils. Um, either silver or um, I have like hollow, which I think would look really nice with this kit. As you can see, I have no problem mixing up my foils. I just, I, I don't, I, I, I really don't. I love mixing foils. I love mixing different colors. These are from Jen. Oh no, sorry. These are from Erin, Melissa, Erin. <laughs> just lots of good stuff from all of my really, really good friends. So all right, so for the big live, I think I want to use a heart and because I we all love Caitlin and we're going to use this from Jen over at Craft Penguin Planner, my, one of my favorite foiled shops. I'll put that right there. And then let's see, um, I do want to film, probably I'm going to end up filming Thursday and Thursday is a big day because Thursday is the Planners Collaborative May sale. And the theme is from, there are my dogs, from uh, coffee to cocktails. So I do want to put a half box so I can write the code. And let's do this purple for the sale. And then I'm going to put this little heart quarter box for filming down here. I'm going to be filming a rewind from another shop that's participating in the sale. Maisie Mc McCrazy, I think is the name. And it will be my Easter rewind. So again, from Jen, let's use these silver play buttons. We'll put that right here. And I'm going to, on Wednesday, need to get the nails all figured out. Friends, I've been trying to do my nails. Um, it's been a lot of fun. I got a shellac kit. Um, like a home kit, you know what I'm saying? I think I'm going to do another appointment label, friends. And I'm going to use an, uh, another foils icon. I got a shellac home kit and... It's, it's colors, uh, they're like different shades of pink and glittery. What's this for? Nails? Okay. Nails, 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 nails. I keep that in my mind as I flip through my binder um, or my album. So, okay, again from Jen. 
And, and some of the colors do really well. Last week, I'm sure if you watched my videos, you saw that I had white nails on. And for whatever reason, this one, which this nail is already short, it just breaks and breaks and breaks. That's a conversation for another day. Um, the white just kept peeling off various nails. But these nails, this pink, I put on, I think, Wednesday. And, like, it's going strong, honey. It's going strong. So if I don't film Wednesday, then I'll film Thursday. My Maisie McCrazy Rewind. I already have the pictures ready. I have, obviously, the kit here. I'm super excited to play with that sticker. It'll be like a mini haul slash... Um, what am I thinking? Come on, Jackie. Keep keep your brain. Keep keep up with your keep up with your mouth. Um, and rewind. And then I'll also film on Mother's Day. I don't think we have any plans for Mother's Day, but I think I'm still gonna put a half box. I'm gonna do the polka dot one. I'll put filming in here. And then if we do something fun for Mother's Day, then I will put something in for that as well. Like, okay, so if we do something fun, I'll put it in the box. If we don't, I'll just put filming in there. You know what I'm saying? Um, typically what we do is um, we go and get ice cream as a family. We've done that the past two years since Jason's arrived. But um, the ice cream place that we typically go to, they don't have like carry out. It's one of those, um, it's one of those yogurt places where you like pick your flavor, your frozen yogurt flavor, and then you can put all your mixins and stuff. So it's really, I like it a lot. It's called Menchies. I don't know if, if where you're watching this, if you have that, if or if it's like a Midwest thing, but um, we do that for Mother's Day. Sometimes Father's Day and my birthday, which all kind of fall within the same um, general time frame. So, um, We'll see if that happens on Mother's Day or not. Okay, so then Friday I put down a quarter box. And this quarter box is for a release that my favorite wax um, shop on Etsy, the Nerdy Wax Company. They're doing a Star Wars themed type release. So I would like to make a purchase. So I'm going to use from Erin at Perfect Prints Co. her icons in silver. And I was debating between the laptop or the money. I think I'm going to do the money because I don't see a shopping bag on here, which is fine. I can use the money. So I'm planning on doing a little spending that day, honey. I know. I know. Also on Friday, I believe Joe gets paid. So let me double check my calendar. Yes, he gets paid on Friday, and I don't know if I have any payday script stickers. I don't typically mark paydays, but I might have one. Let, let's see if I have anything in my leftovers. Laundry, I will need to do laundry. Trash, but the colors don't match. Yep, I don't have anything like that. So let's see if I have something within my icon album, which I think, let's see, let's see, let's see. Here, I have these all these purple icons, which I could certainly use. Okay, so let's pull this out. This is from Wild Summer Designs. And I'm just looking to see if they have Something on here. Here's another money bag, but I just used a money bag. They don't have either a um, shopping or like a money sign I thought could work because I already have the money. I think I'm going to move this one here up to the checklist for Joe's payday and to update the budget. And then for the Nerdy Wax order, oh, I know what I can use. I have a character sticker from Melissa. So let me pull out my character binder. I have a Miss Berry from Melissa spending some money, honey. So let's go ahead. Actually, let's do this cute little Disney one because Star Wars is Disney. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. I love that. That's so cute. So, um, perfect. That all worked out perfectly. I was able to use a little Melissa Miss Berry. I love Miss Berry. I think she's adorable. Okay, so Monday we do need to collect trash 
And I'm sure that in that icons there was a trash can. So let me pull that binder. I keep saying binder, but it's a little album. Back out. Yep, there's a trash. Let's do the deeper purple just because I'm really in love with the deeper purple. And then I also see a laundry icon. So I did laundry today, which is Saturday. I could probably make it till Tuesday. That's that's pretty good. And I'll probably do it again later in the week, but you know. We don't need to mark that this very second. So I think this spread is just about finished for the week. This kit will be 35% off in my shop. So if there were any sheets that you really liked or any of the foils that you saw within the boxes that you really liked, then definitely check my shop out this upcoming weekend to save 35% off. Of course, I can't share the code with you right now because when you're seeing this, it's probably going to be Monday or Tuesday. But if you're interested, the code will be released this Thursday at noon EST on my IG and in my Facebook group and at 11 a.m. EST within the TPC Facebook group. Other shops worth mentioning, other shops that are part of the sale are Melissa from the Sticker Patch. She will be 40% off Jen from Craft Penguin Planner. She will be 40% off Erin from Perfect Prints Co. She is 30% off. So hope that you check out all of my good girlfriend shops. I hope you're having a great and wonderful day whenever you're watching this and I'm sure we will chat soon. Bye-bye y'all.